You've decided your child needs therapy. Now what? What should you look for in choosing a therapist for your child? Keep watching and I will tell you next. Hi there, I'm Kim Feeney with Butterfly Beginnings Counseling and welcome to my channel. I'm a licensed independent social worker and a registered play therapist supervisor with over 10 years of experience working with children and families to lead healthier emotional lives. If you would like this support for your family, subscribe and hit the bell for notifications on the latest content. Your child's emotions are out of control and you've decided to seek out therapeutic support. A Google search shows you multiple options and to be honest, is very overwhelming. When searching for a therapist to help your child, I recommend looking for a registered play therapist or registered play therapist supervisor. A mental health professional with this credential has extensive training, experience, and supervision in working with play therapy. This training, experience, and supervision has been approved by the Association for Play Therapy, a national organization supporting professionals utilizing play to treat clients especially children. Maybe you're wondering why should I seek out a play therapist? Because play is how children communicate their emotions. You can find out more about this in the video above or below in the description. So maybe now you're wondering how do you find a local registered play therapist or registered play therapist supervisor? You can search straight from the Association for Play Therapy website, which is below in the description. If someone local is not available, search for one in your state as a lot of providers are now offering telehealth services as well. Once you have found an RPT or RPTS in your area, feel free to check out their website or social media pages. Give them a call to discuss a free consultation. Most will offer this. Make sure the therapist is a good fit for you, your child, and your family. Drop me a comment below and let me know what qualities you would look for in a play therapist. And stay tuned for next week's video where we will discuss what to expect during your initial play therapy intake session. If you've enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, remember to subscribe and share with a friend. On the screen are some other videos to check out that you might enjoy. Thanks for watching and wherever you are in your day, hug your child and make it a great one.